My name is Melissa Easton and I'm head of the Special Collections Department of the East Baton Rouge Parish Library located on the second floor of the main library at Goodwood, where Baton Rouge history comes alive. Today, we've reached into the library's own archives for our featured item. This ingenious little device is a library find calculator used in the days before electronic pocket calculators, which weren't widely available or affordable until the mid to late 1970s. This simple machine made it easy for librarians to figure out the amount of late finds accrued for an overdue book. The way the calculator works is that every morning, a librarian would adjust the date at the bottom of the date column to the current day using the tiles stored in the back compartment of the box. When calculating a fine, he or she would then determine the fine amount and go up the column to the original due date of the item and find the amount owed. You can see the amounts of the fines ranged from 2 to 10 cents per day. Fines haven't increased very much in the past 40 years. Today, overdue books are still only 5 cents per day. The library always encourages you to return your items on time and pay your fines if you have them. Keep in mind, too, that all fines accrued before 2010 have been waived. Participants who complete our summer reading program and teen and tween readers earn credit for fines. And during the holiday season, we have our Food for Fines drive in conjunction with the Baton Rouge Food Bank, where you get a credit of $1 per canned good towards your fines and help feed the hungry at the same time. See this and many other artifacts of historical significance at the Baton Rouge Room Archive, located inside the Special Collections Department in the Main Library at Goodwood, where Baton Rouge history comes alive. You're watching the May edition of the Library Roadshow, a production of your East Baton Rouge Parish Library System. And just so you know, I used to use that fine calculator, so it's all relative. History is in the eyes of the beholder. But whatever the timeline, the Baton Rouge Room is preserving it for the future. It's all available at the main library on Goodwood, and it's all free with your library card.